Yeah, that looks girly. I would buy this if Yeah. Like, I want this. <laughs> Good morning guys, welcome back to Our Family Nest. So today Carly and I are going to do some sibling gift exchange shopping. Uh, kinda last minute considering it's the Saturday before Christmas, although at least it's not Christmas Eve. Um, well, they're gonna do their gift exchange on Christmas Eve. So first we're gonna run over to the high school, watch Chase wrestle, and then go get something to eat because it's 11 and well, Carly's had a crispy treat so far today. Her hair's still a little wet. So yesterday we did not vlog. It was my dad's memorial service and everything looked pretty well. We were able to put all of the items in his uh, niche that we planned and I took a picture. I will show you guys that. I posted some um, pictures on Instagram as well, like older pictures of like my dad and I and then um, I think I'm going to go through and find some more current ones too and maybe post those here in a few days. So be sure you're following Our Friendliness on Instagram. And what else? There was one other thing I was going to say. I was also going to share that I also posted like on my Facebook last night. I've talked to a lot of my close friends and shared with them about my dad passing away. But it was like I never really just, I don't know, made like a general statement to just people that I know, you know what I mean? Like not just friends and relatives, but acquaintances, I guess you could call them. So I did that last night and it's just, I don't know. Like that's I think the part that I struggle with the most. Like I can be really strong and hold myself together and then you're getting all these like nice comments and stuff and then people are texting me and, and stuff like that because they didn't know until here I went and posted something on Facebook and I don't know. Is there like some rule that you should I don't, I, like, I start to feel guilty, like, that I didn't. Oh, I should have called this person and told her, and I should have told that person, and I don't know. So, it just, last night was kind of rough, so it was a nice day to take off from, um, vlogging and that sort of thing. It was a nice break, and Carly, you said, what, you fell asleep at, like, 9 o'clock at night? Yeah, it was a really long day for everybody, so. All right, we're gonna go in and watch some, ra well, how did your day say, dad say it? Rousling. <laughs> Stand up. Heavy on the elbows. Fuck the head. Target. Carly's complaining. Why are you unhappy, Kyle? Because you park the farthest spot. It's the farthest spot in the lot. Who used to watch the Shaytards back when Shay Carl would always say it was the best spot in the lot if you could get a spot up close. And then when he was doing his weight loss journey, the best spot in the lot was the farthest away. And we're pretty darn near the farthest away because look, we're next to a really nice Mustang. A few cars here to the right of us. And all this is a whole bunch more stores, and there's our Target. I don't even know if you can see it. There's way over yonder. I hate the word yonder. Okay, now you can see how far we are. What? 
You're complaining that it's sunny? Yeah, I hate when the sun is super bright. Oh, I think it feels wonderful. No coats on today. We're not cold. It's sunny. It feels nice. This is how it should be all winter long. If the sun was shining all winter long, I would never be moody and sad. The all right, so Carly is, will not pick out anything. Because she wants me to get like toys and stuff. But he's like 24 and 19 and 17. Okay. They don't want toys. What do they want? Clothes, shoes. What do you think they're gonna buy you? Clothes, shoes. <laughs> Nobody's gonna buy you shoes. Or candles. Like... That's what I want. It's candles. And like I said, it would be a good idea to get Chase a comforter, but it's like you can't buy someone something that big if you don't know what they want. Does that make sense? Yeah. Like, maybe Chase doesn't even want a new comfort. Would Chase like that? Andrew wants to know. Okay, these are the kind of presents I'm talking about. Like, Carly could get this for Chase. It's Ryan's World. It includes one hooded towel wrap, one washcloth, one toy figure, one wash mitt, and one blueberry scented bath bomb. This is perfect. All right, we bought really exciting stuff. Laundry detergent. Lint rollers, makeup wipes. So that was really productive, wasn't it? Very. We got all the shopping done. Oh. The gifts are just invisible. And look at this truck had to come park next to us. Because they're rude. I don't think they're rude. I just think they parked here. Why? Because it's a parking spot. Way out here. Yeah. There was the plenty other, of places to park. Look at other cars way out here. I don't know. I just don't get it. We I need to park it. even further. Next time we're going, we're going to park all the way over there. Dude. By the garbage cans. I think you're being a little too dramatic. What, can cars not park next Wait to Wait till you get a car and you park it next to other cars and then you come out and they bang their door into the side of your car. You, you're going to have to park by people eventually. Never. It's Christmas! Can you please stop? It's Christmas! Dude, you're ruining your video. Dude, stop. <laughs> it's Christmas! I keep singing that, she keeps getting mad. The police are coming for you! Alright, now this is gonna be torture for me. I'd much rather be at Target. A lot of those. All right, we gave up on Dick's. We're at Express, because this is more, even Andrew said he wanted like a nicer shirt or something, not just like. Yeah, I mean. <laughs> you would wear that? It's cute. You think Blake would, I can't see Blake wearing like with the furry. What about that? That one's nice. With the black. That's real. That's really nice. Blake is so hard to shop for. You think? I don't, I don't think so. Now yeah. Blake will go a little bit more preppy. I know. Like, like maybe those sweaters, like that gray one at the end. He liked clothes at H and M too. But yeah, that looks girly. Yeah. <laughs> I like that. It, like it does. <laughs> but Blake's pretty skinny. He's down to 130 pounds. Asha's the booper. She got promoted to booper. So when the time's up, you have to tap the ref because they can't watch the clock. <laughs> Chase has been here all day for wrestling, and he's made it to the finals. Hopefully you guys can hear me over this music.
After wrestling, tell them how the brother sibling Christmas shopping went. Chase lost. Why? At wrestling. <laughs> That's not what I said. Did you see him? Yeah. Yeah, we were there. So Chase had to wrestle. The match will share part of it with you. Chase had to wrestle someone that's third in the state or third, three time state champ. First in the state. Three time finalist, two time state champ. Okay, it was a really good match. It was like, they're both so strong. It was pretty intense, don't you think? Chase told me afterwards, he's like, it's so hard to hate him. <laughs> he's <laughs> such literally a nice the nicest kid. kid there is. Yeah, but he wants to He wants to hate him just yeah, so he can try to, to beat Brian, him. Brian's like, yeah, you can be nice when you're that good. Yeah, no kidding. No, he is, he's just a really good kid. So we brought Ken home some beef, some yeah. dinners, Carly's got some steak. A lot. I wasn't expecting this much. I just wanted my eggs. And some deviled eggs. I got my favorite rattlesnake pasta from J. Alexander's, of course. Why would they say the match is sponsored by our family now? Because so we sponsor that weight class. Why? So they say it every time 119 wrestles. Sure. You don't like that? No, I don't. And then Ballas sponsors a whole too, right? Mm -hmm. Or not oh. a whole. <laughs> What is it? <laughs> that was Not really golfing. dumb. That was a dumb thing to say. Not really, because they do sponsor a whole. I know, but that's not what I meant. You can Anyways, a weight class. Yeah. What if Chase doesn't weigh that weight class? It doesn't matter. Because I pick which weight class he is. But he could wrestle 125, and then you it wouldn't match up class? correctly. Doesn't matter. Anyways. The sibling shopping, what I wanted her to say, is it did not go as I had planned. She ended up getting sensible gifts instead of fun gifts. I wanted it to be like something to make you laugh, you know? Anyways, what are you doing for the rest of the night? Me? Your daughter. Let me guess. Take it a bath. No. I don't want to take a bath. Um, watching something. I am going to take my food to the bedroom. So because I don't want to watch whatever this is back here. And I'm going to watch episode two of The Servant. If you guys have Apple TV, it's this really weird show. You fell asleep. You didn't even see the ending, did you? The ending no, of the first episode. Up. So you had to check it out. I, I seen it advertised a couple times. I'm like, this looks like it might be kind of good. And at first, when I started watching, I was like, oh, it's okay. But it's actually really good. So I'm anxious to watch episode number two. So that's what's happening.